Uh, our defense did a nice job in the second half. And, and uh, you know, they, like I said, I think they surprised with their athleticism. I hate film. You never can tell because you don't know the teams are playing. And you, and you never know really how uh, easy the teams are. But, uh, they, they did an amazing job blocking tonight. Johnny Everett stepped up, did real well. Uh, Nick Hecker did real well. It's just that the line blocking, you know, running backs, I don't care how big or how strong you are. Running backs, you know, you can't do And we moved Joey Collihan to tackle a sophomore, but he's one of them, you know. We, and we kicked Nacko out to tight end. To, got to put a tackle at tight end to give us some more blocking out there after like week seven. And and uh, they they are really a close unit. Uh, they do a lot with the line coach, you know, on and off the field. They have a lineman dinner every Friday. Them with that first drive, and I think that was huge because it showed them we know we're going to be around for a while. And I, I love the, the way the backs all all carried the ball tonight, and mixed it up well. You know, Cody and Jake and and uh, Gary. Those guys are going to be. What a what a hey, Logan. Been injured, you know. Kyle Kramer started the year injured, bad ankle. He we hurt in basketball. We weren't even sure we were going to have him. And then Gary broke his ankle week three and didn't come back to week eight. And Jake aggravates that. Cody's shoulders have been bummed all year, so you know we would just feel fortunate. Hopefully, at the right time.